Peace, Ashe. Shalom. Ashalam alaikum. All my people's righteous. Um, short discussion. It's early in the morning. It's about 6 o'clock in the morning. I'm still up. I'm up giving you guys great news here through all CNN news. I'm trying to give you guys the best news possible, best entertainment possible. I'm still growing. My channel is now maybe 500 and a half, close to 600 strong. I have over 300,000 views on my page. I'm facing a lot of problems with YouTube right now because, first of all, they have increased their user monetization schedule. But make a long story short, I'm going to have a short discussion right now. It's about religion. Okay, we all know that religion itself is 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 what it is. It's religion. If you separate it, it means to take away from to re religion. It means to change from the original course, from its original course. And the original course itself we know was ancient Africa, Aswan, pre commit era, and we can even go back to the Congo. Even in the Congo of Africa we had the golden ages we had kings and queens in the congo and then later our empire extended all the way up into i guess northern africa which is egypt um aswan was up the nile valley and the nile valley is where the river ran upward instead of downwards um a lot of knowledge a lot of our ancestors uh had knowledge house knowledge there and then a lot of the invaders came through, we were invaded by um, Rome first, then Greece second, the Europeans third, and then the Arabs. And along the way, there's a lot of uh, crusades, which is holy wars. How it normally worked was every conqueror gave its prisons of war their religion, and either they honored their religion or they died. So. There it, there it goes, the uh, history of religion. Um, mandated and pressed upon the people. At the same time, you had um, interbreeding with a lot of our ancients, with a lot of the newcomers, which is the Hyksos, etc. Um, but as we know, that religion itself came, once again, um, out of... Uh, the book of the dead or should i say the book of living by day and by night later on europeans title with the book of the dead in that book dead stories of noon nuts and then then the, about creations Heru, um isis and then later on you had a lot of other gods came to replace these gods with your zeus's and Nefertiti and all these other strange gods from the Roman Greco diaspora, and then um, you had also of uh, Europe that came along later. Then you had the invasions of Caesar. Then you had Christopher Columbus who came, and um, and who accidentally ran into Africans that was in America. Um, but a lot of these uh, doctrines themselves were changed and altered, and a lot of truth in the alterations authorizations and a lot of antiques a lot of relics a lot of gold from the tombs from the egyptian pyramids were then stolen out of africa by museums or people in in europe saudi arabia which is the arabs the Greek romans and the greeks a lot of this history is sacred history was stolen and then placed into museums all over the world so truth is spread it out the truth is around there's no truth that can verify anything that actually happened in the Bible. And and that's noted. And and but there you can find, you know, tombs, um, buildings made of stone, which is pyramid, strange, uh, which is incredible, uh, uh masonry type techniques, uh building, incredible building techniques, architecture, etc. And then you have to ask yourself, you know, as a Muslim, as a Christian, you have to ask yourself, okay, and you have to really question history itself, which is his story, and then you have to concentrate on mystery, which is my story, which is your story, 
That's why they change them to history and mystery and all that. It's all words. Of course, the English, you know, uh, language didn't come in to effect until the Phoenicians um, received dialect from ancient um, Nitunita speaking origins. So there it is, history and religion. A brief synopsis of history and religion. And once again, this is from me. I'm in Rossett Heru Hotel. It's a little something that I put together off the top of the head, but in the future I will have more detailed information. And then we can go into the science of languages, we can go into the science of religion, the science of alchemy, the science of the universe, in connection with the human anatomy. Until then, this is your man, Amen Rasset Heru Hotep. Peace. Assalamu alaikum. Shalom. I'm out.